The Electoral Commission has come under the spotlight for what former Premier Mamambabazi's legal team says is violating the inherent rights of their client, whose cardinal sin is to contest for the presidency. The position of the law is that, uh, and that's the Presidential Elections Act, is that uh, one is allowed to be a presidential aspirant, and um, that law allows that person to promote his aspiration to consult. In a letter to the Electoral Commission Chairperson, the Director of Public Prosecutions, the Inspector General of Police, and the Attorney General, Babazi, through his lawyers, Muwem and Company Advocates, faults the Electoral Commission for applying the law selectively. We shall force the issue to comply because it's not about the law. We are all under the law. So we shall take the necessary measures to ensure that they comply. The basis of a possible legal action against the Electoral Commission stems from comments that were published in the Daily Monitor of Wednesday, 17th June 2015, in which Jotham Tadema, EC chairperson, is quoted saying, Technically, we do not know Mbabazi because we have not yet released a program for the campaign. You can't say I want to be president in 2016 before we release our campaign. He's out of order. It was uh, offensive to the law for the Electoral Commission spokesman, who is supposed to be the midwife of the electoral process in Uganda, to claim that uh, an aspirant uh, is not allowed to market or promote himself. My quote, I say if he is consulting, that is not a problem. Mine was on the issue of saying so and so is his agents or her agents are distributing campaign materials. So I want you to separate the two, consultation and campaigning. Muema says Isi cannot feign ignorance about Mbabazi's political roadmap. Our client wrote to the National Electoral Commission uh, a few days ago, uh, notifying the commission that he is a presidential aspirant. I have not received the copy of that letter. Okay. If we get that letter, then we will respond. However, NTV has seen a letter where the electoral body acknowledges receipt. This comes at the time Babazi continues to accuse the police of unleashing a wave of terror towards his supporters. According to Section 3 of the Presidential Elections Act of 2005, an aspirant may consult in preparation for his or her nomination as a presidential candidate before the nomination date. Section 3, subsection 2A of the Presidential Elections Act reads, while consulting under subsection 1, a presidential aspirant may carry out nationwide consultations. Shilandwuchere, NTV.